Hey music lovers, welcome back to Solly Tutorials. In this easy and step-by-step -step video tutorial we will learn how to remix and mash up any song with AI power in Filmora 13. But before we get into the good stuff, take a listen to the original track. Then get up, get dressed Before it works off my list What's left to do, just guess It's you, my favorite But I wanna taste you And feel your shake, raising an earthquake Can't put Now, brace yourselves for the after demo Where we'll showcase the revamped version of this musical wonder Then get up, get dressed It's all thanks to the powerful features in Filmora 13. So, let's groove through the transformation together. Alright. So to make this I remix and mashup songs I have a music in Filmora Media. The link to this music is in the description. Then get up, get dressed. Before it works off my list. You my favorite, but I wanna taste you. And feel your shake, raising an earthquake. First I would like to generate an iBackground music. For this, go to the audio tab and click on it. Click here on iMusic section. Here under generate iMusic you will see start button, click on it. A new iMusic generator window will open. Here first you have to select the mood of the background music. It has total 8 mood. Happy, sad, exciting chill, epic, peaceful, hopeful and emotional mood. Among them I will select happy mood. Then select the duration of the music. You can choose the duration from 20 seconds to 5 minutes. And the count option of generated music is given below, how much music you want to generate. After setting it according to your need, click on the start button below. So within few seconds you will get the results of generated music. To play the music, you will see the play button above the music, click on it. Once you find the music you like, click the download button to download it. Click the view button. Then the I generated music folder will open. I also have pre-downloaded generated music in this I generated music folder. So after downloading the music, the next step to create our I remix and mashup songs is to go to media and click on it. From here, drag the music you want to remix and mash up with iPower onto your timeline. Then get up, get dressed. Split the extra part of this music, and delete it. So I only want this part of the music. Now we have to remove background music from this music. So for that, I right click on that music. And then click on the iVocal Remover option from the context menu. Then the progress of iVocal Remover will start. Please keep a good quality of network status so that there is no obstacle in this process. Once this process is finished, three tracks will be created on our timeline. Its first track will feature original music. Get up, get dressed. 
before it works off my list. The second track will feature the vocals of the music. What's left to then get up, get dressed. Before it works off my list. What's left to do, just guess. It's you, my favorite, but I wanna taste you. And the bottom track will contain only the track's background music. Delete the original music in the top track. Move this empty track to the middle by dragging it down. Go to the audio tab and click on it. Open the iMusic generate folder. Drag and drop the iMusic you have generated and download it into the empty track on the timeline. Mute the background music at the bottom. Add another empty audio track. Drag and drop this empty track below the first track. Then get up, get dressed. What you hear includes background music from vocal tracks and I generated music. Before works off my list. What's left to do, just guess. And with the original background music of this vocal track, it sounds something like this. Then get up, get dressed. Before works off my list. What's left to do, just guess. So I mute the original background music again, and unmute the I generated music track. Delete empty areas from the vocal track. The vocals that are in the vocal track, I split the vocals between all the intervals. And between these vocals I create some kind of gap. Now the next step of creating this i remix and mashup songs is that we will now apply different types of audio effects on these vocals. So for that, go to effects tab and click on it. The first effect I search for here is the echo effect. Drag and drop this effect onto your vocals. Then get up, get click on the three dots option on this effect. And then click on find similar. So you will get all the audio effects. Drag and drop these effects onto your vocals. Use the audio effect that best suits your vocal. All effects should be different. Among these effects, I recommend you to use phone effect, lobby, big room, small room effect, old radio, diving sound effect, and echo effect. We move to the next step to create our remix and mashup songs. So in this step we will apply fade in and fade out transitions to all the vocals. So for that, double click on the vocal, go to the audio panel. And from here apply fade in and fade out to all vocals. Fades in and out act as bridges and remixes and mashups, gently easing listeners between contrasting vocals for a smooth, seamless blend, while also building anticipation and excitement for the next drop or transition. The next step to create this I remix and mashup songs is that we will create a creative and studio-like echo. So for this, I take a duplicate of the first vocal. The shortcut is to drag the vocal with the left click of the mouse while pressing the Alt key from the keyboard and place this duplicate vocal at the end of the above vocal. Double click on this duplicate vocal, turn on the auto normalization option in the audio panel for this vocal, and turn the volume down a bit, about minus 10. I also take a duplicate of the next vocal, double click on it, and change the pitch level of this vocal to minus 12. Now take another copy of the vocal of the track below, place it in the top track. Its position should be at the end of the lower vowel. 
Also normalize this vocal. And similarly for another vocal I create another different echo effect. So again I duplicate the next vocal. Move it a little further in this track. Also normalize this vocal. Add another empty audio track. Move this track to the middle. And take a new copy of this vocal. And drag it to the bottom track. The position of this vocal should not be the same either. Just drag it forward a bit. This vocal is already normalized. Lower the volume of this vocal a bit. Now take another copy of this last vocal. Its volume has to be reduced a little more. And I drag and drop this vocal into the top track. Now we are going to master something new and unique to this vocal, and that is volume keyframes. So at the end of this vocal I add 3 empty keyframes of volume. A shortcut to add keyframes is to left click the vocal while holding down the ALT key. And restore the volume in the middle keyframe. Now take two more duplicate copies of this vocal key, and drag it down into the two empty tracks. Its positions should thus be different from each other. This is how I edit all these vocals. So you can see I have edited these vocals by applying methods and tips and tricks. Maybe you have a vocal in your music that you want to apply throughout the track. So copy it. And paste it next. As you can hear I copied and pasted these vocals. Another secret tip of making this I remix and mashup songs that I am going to show you is to select the special vocals of your song. Click on select clip range. And export it to mp3 format. Click the open folder option, and locate your exported file. Drag and drop the exported mp3 vocals into Filmora. Add another empty audio track. And move this empty audio track by dragging it to the top. And drag and drop the exported vocals into this track. This will make a great change in the background of our remix and mashup songs. Now double click on these vocals. And normalize it with audio panel. Reduce its volume as needed. Then get up, get dressed. Now take duplicate copies of these vocals, as far as you need to apply. So with that our I remix and mashup songs are almost done. But one more trick that I'm going to share here is if your background music is loud as per the vocal, and you want these vocals to be repeated over all the background music. So for this, select the vocals of all the tracks except the background music, and copy it by right clicking on it. And paste these copied vocals forward on the timeline. And finally select background music. Go to the audio panel. And normalize the background music from here. This trick will help our short vocals to make long duration music. If you need to apply the original background music of the vocals, you can also mix it. Otherwise you can also delete it. Then get up, get dressed. And with that we have created a great remix and mashup song using iPower tools in Filmora 13. Alright music lovers, that's how we take any song and turn it into a genre bending banger using the AI magic of Filmora 13. Remember, the possibilities are endless with this powerful software. So grab your own audio gems, unleash your creativity, and let's see what sonic masterpieces you can cook up. Share your own Filmora remixes in the comments below. And don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for more music production tips and tricks. Until next time, keep grooving.